Yeah, holding it down for the Street Profits. Swag meter off the charts, boys. Saxton, what do you know about swag? That's good you didn't answer, so I can talk about Dawkins, who backs up his confidence with top-level wrestling skills. The following contest is an eight-man battle royal, making his way to the ring, representing the Street Profits from Cincinnati, Ohio. Weighing in at 260 pounds, Angelo Dawkins! Oh, you know what time it is. It has been a long road for Angelo Dawkins to WWE success from humble NXT beginnings, but he is finally enjoying the fruits of his labor. The Apex Predator has arrived. One of the all-time greats has seen and done everything there is to do in this and business. Representing RK Bro from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper. You would be hard-pressed to find a more sadistic superstar than Randy Orton. This is a superstar who will do whatever it takes to win. Hey, listen, he's called the Apex Predator because he has this undeniable killer instinct. And the results? Well, they speak for themselves. Yeah, simple advice. Don't cross the Viper. Randy Orton's methodical pursuit of self-serving goals is synonymous with his personality. A superstar who always gets what he wants. My sources tell me that Randy Orton wants you to go home, Saxton. Well, Randy's ready to consume more prey here tonight. You might want to take Corey's advice, Sax man. Shinsuke Nakamura has a bad attitude to match. No, he doesn't. He just doesn't like you, Saxton. And from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the artist known as Shinsuke Nakamura! Uh, question, guys. What kind of artist actually is Shinsuke Nakamura? Nakamura makes art with his brutality. And Byron, he's the type of artist that thrills the WWE Universe with everything he does. He's like a Picasso in the ring. Saxon wouldn't know art in an art museum. I figured you'd like this goof. You probably laugh at all his jokes, too. I happen to find Happy Corbin extremely entertaining. And from Kansas City, weighing in at 275 pounds, Happy Corbin! 
You know, here's a guy who was at rock bottom. He was begging people for money. Yeah. Oh. Then he gets lucky, he strikes it rich, and now he treats everyone like a bunch of idiots. And all it took was one lucky roll of the dice to change Happy Corbin's fortunes. Well, in my opinion, Happy Corbin is one big happy jerk. Spoken like a true loser. The age of Alexander continues. And representing the Hurt Business from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 200 pounds, Cedric Alexander. Guys, Cedric Alexander had one of the best matches in the Cruiserweight Classic a couple of years ago. And it was so good, Triple H came out and applauded the man and then signed him to a WWE contract. You know, you look at every superstar, and every superstar has their individual motivations. Well, for Cedric Alexander, it is simply to be a good role model for his young daughter to prove that as long as you put in the work, you can succeed at whatever you want to do. From Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus! He has got to be in the best shape of his life. And the worst mood of his life as well. Betrayed Drew McIntyre, Cesaro, and the entire WWE Universe. Well, luckily, the Irishman's powerful enough to fight all on his own. I guess uh, this means the conspiracy's continuing. They never stop with this guy. From Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sami Zayn! You know, Sami Zayn was once known as the underdog from the underground. Yeah, then he became the coward from the underground. Yep, bite your tongue, Saxton. Sami yep. Zayn achieved yep. incredible things in WWE. Yep, bite yep. big time matches oh, at WrestleMania. Oh. Yep. Cole gets it, Saxton, why don't you? Yep. He's being condescending. Yep. And people seem to forget how beloved Sami Zayn was. Now all anybody wants to do is complain about him. Well, it's because Sami's changed. Sami hasn't changed. The world around him has. The whole damn show has arrived. And their opponent from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds. Rock Van Dam! RVD is truly one of a kind. From ECW standout to WWE legend, there are few superstars as uniquely talented as Rob Van Dam. We're talking about superstars having educated hands and feet. RVDs have PhDs. This dude is lethal.
Battle Royal rules here. Last superstar remaining in the ring is your winner. Attacks from all angles, temporary alliances, and unexpected action from bell to bell. You gotta love a battle royal. Stop to finish it off. Angel of the Dolphins has been eliminated. There's some power behind that punch. And a slap to it. And it's fired by Sheamus. Good grief. Oh, the elbow connects. That unraveled on Zayn. Simply take it all in. Right to the kidneys from behind. Boom. With the reversal. Back. Snap suplex. Now he's been put on the defensive. No, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Shot. Shinsuke Nakamura has been eliminated. Talk about that. Nice 
isolating the leg. Leg breaker. And Cedric can't stop any offense coming his way. But Cedric's just one move from turning this around. Ooh, that hurt right in the kidney. Golly. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Quick takedown there. to be in right now. Setting up an elimination here. Look at him. Pride and point. Wow, what a win. Corbin with the victory. Here is your winner.